Time now for ABC4 News Sports with Dana Green. Hopefully, hopefully the Jazz will be back at full strength soon. But until Donovan Mitchell and Rudy Gobert come back, the wins are going to be hard to come by, especially against teams as good as the Memphis Grizzlies. Mitchell missing his sixth straight game. But what an opportunity for Daniel House. Fresh off signing another 10-day contract, House led the Jazz with 21 points off the bench. But the Jazz had no answer for Ja Morant. Who does, really? Hits the three here. Grizzlies up by eight at the break. Second half, former Memphis Grizzlies star Mike Conley trying to bring the Jazz back. He had 15 points and six assists. Boyan Bogdanovich struggling from the outside, so he takes his game inside for the bucket. Jazz within five. Mitchell likes it, says, let's keep coming. Let's go. But the Jazz commit 16 turnovers. Morant on the break for Brandon Clark. 22 points, but that finish... Yeah, not impressed. Jaron Jackson says, this is how you finish the giant step. He had 18 points. This Grizzlies team is young and good, but the Jazz keep fighting. Love the effort. On the break, Hassan Whiteside on the right side of that lob, and then it's off the miss. It's Whiteside again. The resounding follow. They're within seven with a couple minutes to play, but Morant finishes them off. He had a triple double. 30 points, 10 rebounds, 10 assists. The final 119-109. That's 10 losses in 12 games, but Quinn Snyder likes the fight his team showed. We were scrambling, playing hard. It wasn't perfect, but you know, scrapping for rebounds. And you're not going to go in the locker room and see a bunch of smiles, but you know, you, you, you probably see some guys that can feel good at least about the you know the way they're competing. Especially in the last week or so, we're we're playing with a much more urgent mindset. And, you know, playing harder. Guys are giving everything they got with who we have out there. And, um, at some point, we're gonna break. We're gonna break through. No moral victories, but we we feel like we're getting closer and closer to to being back 